Well, it was a big Mondag battle at the Armory tonight. Bismarck State, North Dakota State College of Sciences in a fight for first in the conference and a standing room only crowd on hand for this massive match. Mystics trailing in the first set, having some trouble with the size the Wildcats as they jump out to an early lead. Cal Keither gets his girls regrouped and it's off to the races from there. The Linton native Shaley Bosch finishing the first set with a kill as the Mystics take it 25 21. A much better start to the second for BSC, running with a 7 1 start and turning it into this final point from Deidre Wood, the exclamation point. The Mystics move to 9 0 on the season with a clean sweep. And a look at some scores from tonight. The Twins closing out their series against the Angels with a 6-4 win. Minnesota taking two out of three. They'll host Cincinnati over the weekend. Well, it's not often that North Dakota high school athletes are recognized on the national stage, much less for volleyball. But Bismarck High's Madison Foster is breaking the norm as we put her into this week's Sports Spotlight. Bismarck High's Madison Foster may play the most underrated position on the volleyball court. It can be hard sometimes. The senior libero has done her part defensively to lead the Demons to an undefeated start in conference play. And she's finally getting the recognition she deserves. That was very heartwarming and it like shocked me honestly. I was I was very proud of myself. Foster was recently named to the American Volleyball Coaches Association All-American Watch List, an honor earned by just two North Dakota athletes this year. That was mind blowing honestly. I didn't expect it. I think just knowing that over the years I've overcome a lot of things and it shows that hard work pays off. Even if you're not getting that recognition right away, eventually it will come. The hard work has been consistent throughout her career. She's put in so much work. Um, she's never satisfied with what she does, which is what you want out of an athlete. A lifelong setter since her elementary days turned libero during her sophomore season. It could be hard sometimes. I used to get hard on myself, but I've realized that this is my role. I'm going to do what I can. Brianna's helped me a lot filling that role over the couple years. I think I just knew that I needed to do it and just talking to my teammates, talking to my coaches, they've really helped me understand that position. Foster is fostering her role, embracing being a leader and helping the demons take the next step while she shines on the national level. It means everything, honestly, just knowing that other people are also seeing it, even if they can't tell me, like just knowing that someone saw it and like they want to give me that recognition, I think. That feels very great and it makes me very happy. It makes me want to do more things and accomplish more things and just get after it. 